Hey guys, welcome back to the first war of season 39 and this time Jedi Assassins we are fighting against Salty. So this is the very first war so everyone is kind of rusty right now so we were ex expecting like mm, a lot of deaths from both sides and yeah on the section one I had uh, this pad nine on on this uh, this season I'm gonna be taking this uh, path like multiple times I, I believe <laughs> because I have uh, Kimpin rank four and he's white listed so yeah it's gonna be really really useful him uh, on this on this path anyway uh, I was boosting right now because on the very first fight I had to uh, to take down a void. Uh, even even if he benefits from this global from on steady ground, uh, yes, I'm not gonna use Kimpin because that's a very 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 much bad matchup for him. So I brought Cosmic Ghost Rider for this exact fight. So what was this, uh, the strategy here? Just to use a special one boost uh, and then just do a five hit combo ending with a light attack. Then do a five hit combo with ending with a medium. Use my sp my special two. Then uh, because I have cosmic um, power boost active, I'm gonna get my sp three. And yeah, the fight is pretty much over. Uh, it's gonna be it's it's really easy. Like having void here and having CGR available, not banned. It's gonna be a really, really, really easy fight for him. And yeah, uh, for the other two fights, I forgot to record. I, I really forgot I had to upload these uh, videos on this season. I don't usually do, but I was like, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show my audience um, a, a bit of different fights because I'm not used to do the same fights on my two accounts. It's uh, almost always it's different and on this second fight i was really worried like this fight was my the fight i was more worried about on this because uh, I, I had to treat this uh, uh, spider supreme uh, different like as you can see i i started uh, the fight by parrying him that way i was going to activate his face then just wait out uh, to eat expire and then use my sp1 so in case i get hit if my dgen is on on him I, i'm not gonna be um, getting that much damage from him uh, also i didn't wanna dex too much because i uh, he, he benefits from both you know like when he gets a uh, when i get a precision then he gets and uh, it's it's really weird like uh, that's why i was really worried on this fight anyway it ended up uh, being a really good fight for me and on this second fight uh, i had a, a thing uh, thing is really easy for kimping here i don't get it why they put it in here i get that they they used uh, spider supreme on that uh, node on defense on one eye open and I was really worried, like really, really worried. Uh, but anyway, it went well. Uh, and on thing, it's all about uh, keeping the digging on 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 thing. And this time, I was like <laughs> really focused because I I lost my digging and he got a fifteen uh, rock charge. So I was I, I had to bait his sp one. That way, I I would I was going to get rid of those those rock chairs. Uh, and yeah, once I get it, uh, I get it done. Uh, I just uh, use my SP one again and keep it, uh, keep the digging on, and it's gonna be fine. Like this, uh, as you can see on the on the screen, I had two digins, so his ability accuracy is gonna be basically zero. And yeah, it was a really easy fight. I ended up healing a a, a bit, and on the next fight, I had to change my main plan. Okay, I was going to take Arcus with Tigra on my other account, but my 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 friends told me that I could do boss with Hood, so I was like, okay, I can rank for him to make it easy and safer. So I was like, oh, okay, so I can use Kimping against uh, Arcus. Uh, as you can see, almost. Every hit I do 
against Arcus is gonna be glancing. Why? Because Arcus also benefits from this global, and it, it it's gonna be a a, a long fight. Uh, I could use a different champ, but I decided to to use Kingpin instead because it's a really safe fight. Uh, as you can see, I, I used uh, invulnerability boost on this fight in case he didn't wanna. Uh, drop any special like sp1 or sp2 and goes directly to sp3 so i was i was ready for it uh, i i also used um a 30 percent resistance from a special three just in case just uh literally <laughs> playing extra safe here because the war was really really close like at this point uh, we were tight like five to five so uh Whoever was going to die one more time was taking the the low the loss here. So yeah, as you guys as you can see, I have two overpowered. So my damage, even if my hits are glancing, it's gonna be huge. And sometimes when I don't have any rage on me on Kimping, my hits won't glance. So my damage will be normal. As you as you as you saw, I had like a 40 40k damage. Uh, crit uh, Kimpin is just insane like <laughs> uh, right here I was like like okay I'm just gonna use my sp1 I still have my invulnerability boost on so yeah it took it took a while but it was a really safe fight for me and on the last fight this is a oof a nice fight I didn't expect to be that good to be honest um, I was big, big boosted because, uh, as I said, uh, the the war was tight. We were fight to fight. So, oof, first time ever that I'm gonna be doing hood. Uh, well, null with hood. And um, I'm used to to use Rintra here. I I prefer Rintra to be honest. But uh, this time, on steady ground, it can be annoying. So, what's my strategy here? It's just to build. Um, five detox uh, charges that are from global attack. That way I can get rid of those abyss charges from null ability. And then once I get it, that's it. He's not gonna be uh, unblockable anymore. Then I can start um, char charging my hexes charges. So I can detonate them when I have a lot, right? So I used also Mystic Power Boost because uh, when I was throwing my SP2, look at that. I was getting almost one bar of power uh, because of the power steal that Hood has and also uh, some damage that it also do, right? So uh, I was trying to do a lot of intercepts every time I could. Uh, also, I was trying to bait heavies trying to not get hit by sp1 or null that not throw the sp1 that can be risky like that's the only risk when using hood here uh, because when he uses sp2 i'm usually on face okay so when hood is facing he can actually not head hit head hit uh, by the special and miss and actually get some hexes charges back so it's really really sa a safe fight for him and then i got i got clip <laughs> here it could have been a, a perfect fight but yeah it's me so i have to fuck it up <laughs> and yeah i had like almost 40 hexes charges so i throw my sp2 here then i got the face and i i was just waiting for the for the heavy and that's it 200k damage almost 250 uh, it was just flawless man <laughs> i really love it uh, this fight and yeah uh, yeah uh, the war ended at uh, six to five uh, they ended up dying one more time to our boss in bg2 and we didn't die anymore so we took uh, the first win of this season uh pretty pretty rusty uh, sis, uh, first war because uh, on BG2 we died like three times and on BG1 one uh, two, and yeah my B my bar group uh, started really great like we did the first donut of the season, uh, hopefully we can.
continue like that and yeah guys uh, if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button subscribe if you haven't and let me know on the comment sections uh, if you understand <laughs> anything or what's up now uh, anyway guys uh, we'll see you on the next one see ya